G'day tradies, my name's Jamie Gray and I'm here with my good mate Matty Page. How are you bud? Good mate, how are you? Very well, thanks. Look, we're here on the northern beaches, the cicadas are singing. It's about 40 degrees and it's going to be an awesome day and I'm pretty excited. We've got the Festal Saw here to have a look at. What can you tell us about it? Yeah mate, we've got the HKC uh, 55 which is the pretty much the Rolls Royce of the Cirque Saw world. Oh, it's a builder and Chippy's favourite that one too, isn't it? Uh, even a Sparky. Mate, why don't we um, have a little bit more of a detailed look and you can tell us about some of the key specs? Sounds good. Perfect. Yeah, mate, well obviously it's the uh, it's got the 55mm cutting depth for your ripping and cross cuts. Uh, the safety pendulum, massive one. It's right next to your left hand. You don't know more like going across so, the saw So plate. easy to access, hey? A lot safer, a lot easier, more stable. Yep. Um, the other thing as well, it's got the uh, plunge cut setting. Beautiful. Pretty awesome. Yep. Set that depth really easily. Yep, got easy to set depth gauges. Yep. Yep, and I guess something that just you can't ever say enough about is just the portability of the system, right? Exactly. It's such an easy system to use and get around site with. Perfect. So look, why don't we actually grab some timber? There's some um, bird's mouths that need to be cut out there on some rafters. So why don't we jump up there and we'll get into it? Good. Awesome. Okay, changing the blade on the HKC is super simple. Just pull the lever forward, locks the blade, the Allen key out. There you go. One of the really cool features about the HK series is its compatibility with the crosscut guide rails. Okay, setting the crosscut guide rail is extremely easy. Uh, set it to zero, just place the timber against the back, or we can set it to 45 degrees one way and uh, 60 on the other on the small one, or 60 to 60 on the larger rails. The beauty of this system, it gives you the ability to cut perfectly cut angles every time. Okay, so we're only cutting rafter tails today, but if we were doing battens or LVLs up on the roof, uh, being able to bring the saw to the timber rather than the timber down to the compound saw is going to save you a bucket load of time during the day. All right, Maddie. so you've just done a few cuts. We got you up on the rafter tails out there. How did it feel, both, I guess, in terms of weight and power of the saw? Mate, the motor was amazingly smooth, eh? It didn't feel like it was stupidly powerful, but you know it is. Yeah. Um, that's probably the great thing about it. It's so light, compact, yep. and portable. And um, it can cut anything you throw at it. Yep. And yeah, just smooth as silk. And, and sort of looking over your shoulder there, I guess, the precision of the saw and the quality of the cuts on the edges and stuff is so detailed and so precise. Second to none, there's no chipping, super smooth. We love our Festal. <laughs> and what kind of battery is it running with? Mate, we're running a 5.2 amp hour lithium ion battery. It's got the new Airstream technology, which will give you uh, rapid charging. Perfect, that helps a lot too when you're on site, doesn't it? Awesome. So Maddie, I guess that has to wrap up another tradey tough test, but I think we're gonna have to give this the seal of approval. What do you reckon? Without doubt, mate. Let's do it. Awesome. And until next time, guys, stay safe on site and take care. Bring it back.